Hey folks, so I wanted to talk to you about the state of Project Thursday. If you noticed, I didn't do one last week. Here's the deal. If you've been paying attention, I'm producing a web series called Less Than Heroic, which is a comedy, fantasy, Dungeons and Dragons type of uh, web series. And it's taking up a lot more time than I thought it would. So, I'm officially making that my Project Thursday project. And once that's done, I'll go back to the original list of projects. Um, so today, I wanted to tell you a lot more about Less Than Heroic. First of all, it's technically a spin-off of a web series called Chaotic Good Online. Time for the party to embark upon the quest of the Cave of Abandon. No, we can't leave now. I mean, who's gonna take care of Kirk Cameron? I mean, Prince Kalen. I think the cleric had it under control. You like masonry? I like masonry! Speaking of clerics, should we hire an NPC to help us with this quest? I mean, the prince did say it was above our level. What about the cleric we just met? Ooh, don't tell me! I've only read the first five books, <gasps> but have you seen the movies? I didn't like her. Well, if you change your mind, I could play her to help out. I wouldn't mind having two shladies in the party. That's just so that you could borrow each other's dresses. It's a robe. It gives plus four to wisdom. It's decided then. We depart for the cave as soon as we retrieve the cleric from Prince Kalin's infirmary room. Yeah, so... There's that. So it's like really cool. It's like... You like chainmail? I like chainmail. It's like a combination of like the guild and like Roger Rabbit and like fantasy Dungeons and Dragons comedy stuff. Cause it's got like two stories. It's got like the people at the game table, kind of like the guild. But now now clad in shimmering Talesian steel, declares it time for his party to embark upon the quest of the spirit of Unthar. All right. What? Unthar is way back the way we came. Fortnall has spoken. The Unthar quest is stupid. Fortnall begins moving towards the south gates. On speed. Really? Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. Ross and Mata, in a fit of passive-aggressive freshman rage, cast Fireball at Fortinall, which dissipates inches before landing on his brand new Talesian steel armor, which is world-renowned for its resistance to fire. And checkmate. And then the people that they're playing who are in the world, like Dungeons and Dragons going on, which is actually a combination of like animated drawings and live action actors. I'm in love! <laughs> if she's close enough to hug him, he's within range. Fireball. No! Thirty-four versus reflex. So, what's our- So it's neat, because there's really no web series doing anything even remotely close to that. There's a few D&D &D web series, uh, but they're either all at the table, or all in realm. We do everything. Plus we've got that cool animated thing going on. So I think it's a really cool project. Um, so I'm putting my heart and soul into this, along with the four writers. Graduated Hit magma with... cum laude. Hit me with your best hot. hot. <laughs> so dumb. I like magma cum laude. So we're fundraising on Indiegogo. Um, we started a few days ago, and we've already reached $122, which isn't bad. But we're trying to get 7000 to do our first five episodes. That's slightly more than a thousand an episode, which really is not a lot of money. Um, but it's, it's a huge amount to us. So if you can help us out, that would be great. And we're not just asking for donations. We're giving something in return. There's, there's stickers, photos, crazy things. Uh, if you are a Dungeons & Dragons player, for 50 bucks, our head writer will call your DM to try and get you like 10,000 experience points. Stuff like that. The cool thing about this series is you don't have to be a role player, you don't have to know Dungeons and Dragons to get the jokes, but if you do, there's more there for you. This is just a fantasy thing. It's a fantasy comedy thing. So if you liked Willow, or The Princess Bride, or The Guild, then you're gonna like this. It's fun. Uh, they're quirky characters. The episodes are gonna be short, but not as short as Chaotic Good Online. Those were like two to three minutes. We're shooting for four to six minutes an episode now, and uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. 
So go to lessthanheroic.com. You can see all of the Chaotic Good Online episodes there and all of our progress. But please, let, let me know what you think. Check out all the links. Follow and fan and, and, and interact with the Daily Booth. There's really cool things happening. Uh, Essium, our head writer, does live drawings and stuff on his Ustream channel. We put those on the blog. Uh, we're taking like behind the scenes footage that'll start coming on our YouTube channel as well as Thursdays on my channel. I'll put some of that stuff up and uh, live streaming, tons of stuff. We're going to do an event in Los Angeles sometime as soon as I figure out when. I'll let you know more about that. So, uh, so keep watching. Uh, let me know what you think. And uh, we're going to be casting December 12th. So I want to know based on uh, who you know is in Los Angeles, if there are any YouTubers you'd like to see on our web series. Let me know who, check out the blog for the, the, uh, the roles, and let me know what role you think they should have. Um, Alright, that's about it, and uh, stay strong, folks.